You guys, where is everyone? I have the worst news. They're out of reaches. And other stuff. Sometimes news is just so not good. Playing that game, huh? Sometimes life hands you lemons, man. You know? It just happens that way sometimes. I know, sometimes you just can't control stuff. But a heart attack, are you going to ask for a heart attack? Are you going to ask for a psycho to basically ruin your life by telling you what's going to happen to you? Kevin, did you take that book that I was just reading and use it as toilet paper? Um, you oh, mean the Twilight brand of toilet paper? Yeah. Yeah, no, yeah. yeah, that one. It's my favorite book. That that was an actual book. Yes. Oh. It's not just if there's your news is not as bad as my news. What is going on? I saw a psycho today. They told me. What does he mean? They read your future. They tell you like they read your palms. It's not a psycho. They read your they read palms. Your okay, they read your palms. You and saw they, a psychic. They scan your butt and know like how long till you die. And I don't so. think that's how it goes. But I think you mean a psychic. Oh, you're right. A physicist. That's. No, yeah, the ones that, right, the guys that tell your future. A psychic. Right. A and psychic. repeat after me. <clears throat> a psychic. A psychic. No. A psychic. A psychic. Okay. That's the closest Good? A psychic. <laughs> okay. Anyways, but like it was brutal because they told me like basically like when I'm gonna die. Yeah. What like, did they say? She's like, oh, you like may not live until you're 30. Oh, Stupid. I wonder how she got that. I don't know. She's wearing a stethoscope around her neck. Like, okay, that was your doctor, actually, and she's probably right, but... That was mine. Uh, what made you go see a psychic today? Okay. Um, there has to be a reason to see a psycho. They have powers, John. Do you not know this? Like, I thought she was going to tell me, oh, you're going to win lotteries one day. You're going to, like, get all of the Reese's that you ever wanted. And your cousin won't bicker about having to pay for all of them and stuff. And oh, you're gonna win like a hamburger farm where you can just make hamburgers all day and eat them and there's no charge. And guess what? I don't want onions on them, Mom. I haven't been paying any attention, but it's a book for the part where you're gonna die or something. Yeah, soon, she said. Based on your health, I believe it. You don't believe it either? I do believe it. Good, thanks for joining the conversation. Mm-hmm. For sure. For sure. You wanna know. Kevin, this psychic actually, he's right, does sound pretty accurate, but come on, psychics, it's not like it's all going to come true. So exactly. What I would probably do, like what I see you doing is maybe not in your future, this is my prediction here, okay? Go ahead and do this. I You're see, psycho? Uh, some might say, I see you maybe not wasting your money on really? things like a psychic or things like that, you know? Maybe actually using that money to pay me back for the thousands of groceries you've eaten and the many rolls of toilet paper you used. Maybe we do that instead. And actually maybe try to do something better with your life and time than napping all day, going to visit a psychic for 10 minutes, then coming back here to scarf down on Reese's. Like, that's just not a good use of time. Like, use this as a sign to fix your future now. You know what I mean? No. That was a very horrible prediction. You're not a very good psycho. Hmm. Stick to your day job. Am I right? Probably not. <laughs>